Hello and welcome back to another Adventure Times where we're today. Where are we Hayley? We're at Fancy Island we're for the um, Fear, Fear Island. Island Press VIP day. Preview. Thank you to Fantasy Island for inviting us down tonight. We can't wait to experience what's on offer. We're also wait. here with Hayley's sister Molly. Say hi Molly. She's so nervous. <laughs> Let's get in and do this Halloween event. Oh, oh. oh. This one right here. Oh. Oh no. Oh. 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 Two oh. Son. What do you think of my son? He's lost his mom out and we're looking for a new one. <laughs> I reckon She's you. Perfect. I reckon you should come with us. Yes. What do you think, boy? I'll tell you what, Papa. Let's take Let a... me go and find Cletus. Let's yeah. take a look at both of them and see which one tastes better. <laughs> <laughs> hin hin. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. I mean, she's already got the shirt. We need to see what this one can dance. Can you dance? I don't know, Cletus. Find out. Come on, guys. Go on, guys. Come on, guys. Go on, dance. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> oh wow. Welcome. Hi there, welcome, welcome. I'm Jeffrey Custer. I'm not dead. Are you not? No, no, I'm not dead at all. Not dead, not dead at all. No, not dead, not dead. Be careful for the hug. She likes to give it flesh. Nice. Oh wow, this is amazing. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, where did you pop from? Hey, Mama's trying to find a way home. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like your boots? Raw or medium? Oh. Medium? I think this one's better well done. <laughs> Shall we head it? Did you enjoy that, Hayley? Oh, that's one entrance. That was it? an entrance and a half, to say the least. I think I chose the wrong shirt. You did pick the wrong shirt. You're now there, Mama. That's all right. Hello, here comes my son again. <laughs> okay, the circus here. We were greeted with some champagne. We've got a dance going on in the background. Madness. But yeah, we'll be wind and dine well and truly tonight. So, thanks, Fancy Island. More like to saying hello to us. Look at the outside of Psycho Mansion, it's incredible. And the first place we're off to, well, we're ravenous. doing ravenous. So, what they've told us is because it's wet and it's cold and everything else, we're being we've kept. We've been split into three groups, and then, like, we're doing them the first three attractions in a triangle, and then we, we just, go back. Yeah, yeah, once we've done all but three, we it's go very back sensible there, and it's well just... thought out. And thankfully, we shouldn't get too wet. So, yeah, Let's go have some fun. yeah. We'll give you our review after we've done this first one. So we've just come out about ravenous and after probably half an hour wait maybe for it, 
Um, he experienced it. Um, it. The theming in there was on point. I'll, I'll give them um, that. The scariest part for me was being split from everybody at the beginning. Oh yeah, Heidi got taken but away. They kind of picked on me because I've got the buffalo plaid shirt. So yes. It, it didn't, yeah. Um, I thought it was well themed. Uh, the head scene, especially when he just chucks it along the floor, that was. I mean, clever. yeah, it was great because that kind of dragged blood around. That was that was incredible. Um, I don't know. Maybe if we missed something, because other groups were taking their time, so I don't know if maybe stuff was skipped. However, we are coming back tomorrow. Yeah. So we will be able to do it again. Yeah. I don't know. It was. It was like, It was a. It was good. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It was. A bit of a wait, but it's all right start. It was an all right start. It was an all right start. Good theming, plenty of actors, and there was a chainsaw. Can't go wrong with a chainsaw. On to the next one. Very um, eerie with all the rides. Shut, obviously. But the next one we are doing. Next one is Outpost. See what this one's like, and we'll share our review when we come out. We've just come out of Ravenous. What do we think, guys? No, we haven't. We come out of the Outpost. So we've just come out of the outpost. What do we all think? That was good. That was really good. That's true. I like that the beginning of that. I must admit, it I was. It was a unique. Yeah, with the, with the lift, it was sort of rattled, which we've seen a few times in the different places. Um, but it was just the um, the bit at the end, because I was right at the back. I was chased by zombies. I thought, I want to go and run it. And like, no one was running. And... No, because the front of the group will be yes. slowed down by the zombies. Oh, God, so... I thought I was going to be eaten alive. But that was. <laughs> I'd say that's probably better than Ravenous. Probably, yeah. yeah. I would agree. Um, but, on to the last one, there's our food. Yes. Let's go. The next one we're doing is the crypt. It's very eerie. It's like no one here in the pyramid is there. Excellent. Okay, so we're going to go into this one. Now there is a step down. So just be careful, because we do want to spook, but we want no broken necks, all right? So we just come out of the crypt. Uh, definitely a lot more family friendly, uh, mild scares. All the scares came at the end, actually, the maze, I'd say. It was actually quite fun, I quite enjoyed Yeah, it. it was good fun. It wasn't scary. Um, again, quite well themed. And yeah, would you anything to add, Molly? Yeah, I think it was quite good. Quite good. A mix of different scares and them. If we bring in families along, that's the maze for you, I'd say, at the minute. And the best part is, I don't know, still is in the food. No, we're now going to go back towards go the circus tent. We're going to have watch some food show. and watch the circus. So, yeah, and then, then I think we've got one more, one more thing to do, and that'll wrap up the evening for us. Yeah. Now that it's got dark and stuff, Psycho Mansion looks really good. I'm not going to lie, and obviously the sun's just going down as well. I'm not sure how well it's playing over the audio. They're playing the Smiler soundtrack over the circus. Complimentary of Fantasy Island, so thank you Fantasy Island once again. We get some food, we've got some chili nachos, nachos and garlic bread. Yeah. Here we go, I will get the name of this circus right. This is the Circus of Screams that we're just waiting for. It's going to start in about a few minutes. We'll put some highlights in of the show.
the circus of screams and it was okay they're very very talented that's for sure especially the women that can burn their legs in every which way and direction i mean that's amazing um yeah what do you guys think of the circus of screams it was good i like michael myers at the end oh yeah yeah it was a good addition it's great it's okay well worth a watch I'm not sure if we mentioned it yet, but there's also signs up telling you which way for all the mazes and how many steps. It's really good actually. But yeah, I'll just show you a quick tour of Fantasy Island at night time. And it's lit up. I love coasters that are lit up. One thing Merlin parks don't really do is they don't like the coasters up. Which I really wish they did, because it really does do an amazing effect. And come the end of Halloween, I'm sure there'll be people on Millennium and Odyssey at night. Get to experience it when it's like this, it'd be amazing. But yeah, we're just gonna get back over to the mazes. And we're gonna take a few photos. And do a few videos and stuff. I'm sure if you follow us on our Instagram, Adventure Times underscore official, you'll um, see the photos already before this book. Oh, oh, the door! God. <laughs> I just really <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at all this. You've got a hand it to him, though, haven't you? No. You have. Oh. oh, just look in there. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> Be on your way. On your way. We'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> what are you pointing out there at me for? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> That's scary. There's risky business. That's <laughs> scary. <laughs> I like, no, got someone following me. <laughs> so, with Fantasy Island um, inviting us down, they've actually given us the opportunity now to go inside the mazes for pictures and small videos and stuff, which is what we're doing. It's really good. The actors are very interactive. Um, they're not shy for pictures, and, and in some ways, dare I say it, actually better than when we went through the first time. I hate to say it, but I'm enjoying this slightly. The mazes were fine, I'm not criticising them. But I'm enjoying this, seeing the sets up close in our own little bubble, talking to the actors, interacting with the actors who are still in character. Um, yeah, and we'll do anything for our selfies. It's good, it is good. I'm not sure if you can see me, but one thing with the crit, remember the step when you walk in and don't fall down it. I'm lost, I can't get through a cone. Oh, here we go. First thing is you don't notice, you don't notice a lot of the theming when you first go around. Oh God, and I keep tripping over everything. Wrecking the place as well. <laughs> and with this one, you also have to go through a, a crawl. I'm still going to say it, Fantasy Island is the best themed indoor area in the country. So our last walkthrough that we've got to do, just do some highlights and pictures of the outpost. Um, yeah, they still feel really bad. It, we're still getting better run throughs now. I feel Me bad. and Molly got proper scared in that one. Yeah, Not scared, but we got proper, <laughs> proper jumped on that one, and the zombies were literally all over us come the end. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was good. <laughs> I shouldn't say that because, yeah, but we're having good times. But we're now off to do Psycho Mansion, which. We don't know what to expect other than it looks like a fun house that you see at a fun fair. Just zombified and horrid up. So take you in and show you around. I don't know if we're allowed to film or not, but we'll, uh, we'll see what we can get. 
scariest house in this That house looks amazing, especially in the dark now. Psycho Mansion. That's gonna work. Oh! So as you can see, we're not at Fear Island anymore, Fantasy Island. I'm actually back at the hotel. because I forgot to do a review. I forgot to do a review of Psycho Mansion. Anyway, Psycho Mansion is pretty much uh, a fun house, just gutted out and, and changed. What did you think, Hayley? I actually, it was my favourite maze. And the thing is, for them to actually turn a fun house into that, it's unique. Nowhere else has ever done it. No, it's not particularly scary. Uh, there's a few jump scares in there, but nothing major. It's not horrific, no. It's family friendly, I would say. Well, is it? Yeah, places. Sort of. It's not. It's not like mild, horrific. Mild scares. Uh, yeah, it. it's more like jumpy, like woo, mm. I'm here, ha <laughs> that sort of thing. But and a cool everything. ending, and a cool ending, very yes. cool ending. So that brings our night here at Fantasy Island to an end. As morning's just shining us up quite nicely. Um, yeah, no, it's a really good event. Obviously, we were here for the VIP slash press night. What did you think, Hayley, to the event? I really enjoyed it. There were a couple of hiccups, but that's to be expected. Um, best maze for me was Psycho Mansion, and it was left to last as well, which is brilliant. I liked the surface, but I feel like once you've seen one, you've seen them all. Best part was Michael Myers, though. Yeah, fair enough. Molly? Yeah, I liked it. Um, I would say the outpost was my favourite. The zombie one? Yeah. Um, Really time, yeah. yeah, no, it was, it was good. I think Ravenous was my favourite one just because of the set design, it was amazing for it. But yeah, it's not the most how do I put this? It's not the most frightening. Is that the word I'm looking for? What's <laughs> yeah, it's it's not like intense. I think it's I don't want to say it's playful, it's good, they to, can be, but... I would say it's a good starter horror event. Yes. If you're new to going to horror events, yes. it's a good starter one, that is for sure. Having said that, if you've never done some of the things that we've done, like Cully's and the Howl and stuff, that are a bit more intense, this would be, I feel, yeah. not necessarily like, oh my god, mind-blowing intense, but I feel like this is a good mid-range, I think. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. They're well, well thought of mazes, uh, other than the rain today, so big puddles everywhere. But yeah, yeah but it is what it is. It you is can't what it say is. Anything about the weather. No. Anyway, we'll do another day with a full day vlog coming up tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next adventure. Bye.